Uh, we have Greg with us today. Greg, you're, uh, this is what, your third? My fourth. Ah, oh, four time. This is the beyond a grand slam. This is the grand slam today. Okay, that's good. Now, Greg, do you want to tell anybody? You want to talk to our little audience here? Let them know how you're feeling. I feel phenomenal. I mean, the experience couldn't have been better from start to finish. Um, I mean, what is there to say? My confidence is through the roof. Um, I'm smiling at myself. It's like A1 treatment, A1 treatment. Well, we got to get the word out, Greg. Got to get the word out to the world because a lot of guys need this and they don't even realize that this is available. You know, that's the thing. So that's what you're helping us with too. So by you sharing your story, you're going to help more guys, their marriages, their relationships, very positive impact we're talking about here. I feel like a lot of, a lot of men are, you know, um, they're scared. They're, they might be ashamed. Um, they might have, you know, anxiety through the roof to actually, you know, come to terms with what's going on. And, you know, as soon as you come to terms with reality, the sooner, you know, you can get help and be right here where I'm at, changing your life. That's right. That's what it's about. Look, women do it all the time. Right? They're doing their boobs, their lips, their behinds, their feet, their hair, whatever. It doesn't matter. Their hair. They get every part of their body gets affected in a positive way. It's cosmetic, but you know what? Makes them feel good. So the bottom line is what do men want? Men want usually more hair. <laughs> Greg is thinking about it. Uh, more hair and a, a bigger a bigger penis, right? So that's the idea. That's uh to take care of 99% of our wants and needs, so to speak. We're gonna do a little evaluation first. Okay, I see where the deficits are. Well, I see that spot there. So we'll balance all that, fill it up. Now there's no limitation in size, right? I can go as much as I feel. Okay, good. So that's what I'm gonna to do. Today, the objective is to fill as much as possible. Of course, if you need a little balancing here and there, this is artwork, this is like sculpting. Okay, so we need to sculpt a little bit here and there. You put filler in and you have to smooth things out. Put a little more here, a little more there. Smooth it out. This takes about, you know, we're going to do shaft and glands today. The glands is the head of the penis. Uh, we'll do both. We're moving along. I'm about mid shaft, putting, fill, putting filler in. And we're gonna put a lot, because when you get this size, and Greg's pretty big now, um, what we need to do is, to get to the next level, you wanna putting a lot more filler in. So Greg, you have a, you're not married though, right? No, I'm engaged. Not yet, you're engaged. Ah, engaged, that's good. You made that possible. Uh, I made, oh. You made that possible. <laughs> you did I made that. it possible. You did. <laughs> Prior to you, I didn't have a relationship. You made it possible for me to have a, a relationship and a fiance and wow, so that's and impressive. Kids. Yes, you did that. Wow, this wow. procedure did that. Well, you see how psychologically it impacts us as men. I mean, Greg is amongst millions and probably billions of men who think the same way. I mean, that's the probably the, the fact of the matter, and so forth. So that's a really good, strong testimony, and I'm glad to hear. So I didn't know, Greg. You may have told me before, but I don't remember that you got engaged. Prior to coming to Lawyer Medical, I, uh, I was like, a, I was an introvert. Um, you were an introvert. I didn't, I didn't. You did a lot of video games, didn't you? Did yes. you send me that? Yes. I was right. a, I was a, a heavy gamer. Um, it was from work, home, playing my games. Um, I didn't want to talk to no females. Because what if a girl said, here's my number? It's like, what am I going to say next? It's like, I'm going to start stuttering, you know? So it's just yeah. like, I just avoided female interaction at all costs. Wow. After coming to Lawyer Medical, I am a complete extrovert. <laughs> I can't stop talking. I don't know if this was good or bad. I don't know. No, <laughs> this it's good because you literally changed say. my life. Changed my life. Changed my life. That's good. And that is why Greg is here. For the fourth time. For the fourth time. That's right. And the guys have to know that. They really do have to understand that. A lot of guys don't even know this exists. Right? They don't know this exists, and they say, I didn't know that was a thing, they say, you know? So, we want to make it a thing. So, we're going to get a lot of filler in today. Now, Greg, I have a personal question to ask, and you could answer it in 
simple terms, uh, you're going to get a substantial increase in size. Are you sure it's going to fit? <laughs> we'll make it fit. <laughs> we'll make it fit. I like that. We'll make it fit. I, uh, we'll make it fit. Because I always tell guys, you know, believe it or not, there's certain sizes that might be too big for certain women. And, and so we have to be careful of that. So when's the wedding date? Hopefully, hopefully within the next year. Okay. Hopefully within the next year we can tie the knot. So you got engaged. That's just nice. And tell me about the lady. She, uh, what, what kind of work does she do? So she is a cosmetologist. She cuts hair? Mm -hmm. Does all that? Okay, good. Uh -huh. She uh, is a cosmetologist. Well, basically uh, it's like a, a children's boutique. Uh, okay. So parents take all, just all kids there. And uh, yeah. And how'd, you, how'd you meet her? Uh, I used to work for a, a sports bar and uh, she used to work there as well. And uh, we started off as friends and uh, I hadn't had this procedure yet. Uh, when we actually became official, you know, having like, uh, having a, a relationship, you know, but I always kept this part, the intimacy part at bay, different excuses. Uh, uh -huh. My my biggest excuse uh, I had told right before my procedure, right when I had found you, I had told her that uh, I, I accidentally got my skin of my penis caught in my zipper, zipper in my jeans oh, and I geez. tore my skin. Ah, and creative. That's, that's creative. why I couldn't have sex. So it kind of made sense once once I was going to get, you know, all bloody or whatever, all, you know, swollen. You got an alibi, excuse. my right, friend. Right, that was the alibi. alibi. I got you. So I just recently came clean and, you know, told her. Oh, you her, did? Good. Yes. Okay. Just recently and came clean. And she was clean. on board with it. I mean, after now, you know, let's see. We laugh at it now. We can laugh, you know. Right, right, right. right. We can laugh at it now. All right. Well, we're heading on finishing our second quarter area almost. Everything is filling up very nicely. Now, I want to say a few things to Greg. Re Greg, remember, when we're done, it's going to look swollen, but it shrinks down. So the size you see here is not what you get, right? But I do expect a solid inch gain out of you, which should be probably it. Yep. Probably it. Now, if, if your wife has children, of course she will, and maybe have a few, God willing. You know, the... The vaginal space, if she has a natural birth, which is healthier for the child, if she does, that might change things a little bit. But considering your size that you're going to get to, I think you're already ready for that. Right, 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 right. So you should be okay. You should be just fine. Hey, guys. So I just finished my fourth procedure. Literally the easiest thing ever for my fourth time now. Came in in the morning. Uh, it's, what, 1227 now. Uh, I'm about to leave here now, collect my belongings, go to the airport, and I'm gonna still make it home for dinner. It's that easy. No pain, no discomfort, no time away from work, so you'll not miss a beat. I'll be at work tomorrow. Look at me. I feel phenomenal. I feel great. And my confidence is higher than ever. Come see him. You will not regret it. <laughs>